There is nothing like love. Nothing starts with such colossal hopes and ends with a dramatic collapse. So maybe we don't understand what romantic love is. Love is the ability to give, and it is tied to who you really are in the core of your being. So what does it mean to give? What can you give? You essentially give your life, your vitality, happiness, understandings, humor, and grief, everything that is alive inside of you. By being generous in love, you enrich your lover's life. You increase his or her own vitality. Giving in romantic terms means to awaken reciprocal behavior in the other, so the two of you can share the happiness from what you both have given life to. This is what to choose love every day means, and it is essential that both lovers participate actively. You might ask yourself, how come I give everything I have and it still does not work out? The truth is that generosity in the context of romantic love is tied to the degree to which you have developed yourself and your character. It is believed that our core has a creative, productive nature. In order to truly express this, however, we need to overcome the dependencies from the external context, narcissism, the wish to exploit others and accumulate wealth, among others. In other words, to develop yourself is to create an inner space within you through which you can experience a loving relationship. In this sense, for the creative character, the act of giving is the highest expression of self-power. It is rooted in our state of identity, born out of our own unique talents and abilities. Now, what love is not? Let's make a distinction between falling in love and long-term love. Being crazy about your lover is usually perceived as being evidence for the strength of your love. <laughs> but it can be also a proof for the depth of <sighs> one's own loneliness. In reality, free will is often a neglected aspect of long-lasting love relationships. If love was just a question of strong feelings, why would there be a promise to love eternally? How can you promise something without the active help of your own judgments? In conclusion, in its essence, love is a mutual work of movement and growth. Harmony, conflict, joy, sadness come second to the fundamental fact that two beings are connected from the core of their beings. In love, every detail comes to life and has new dimensions. And this is where the beauty of life lays, in a rich, multi-dimensional view.